there was a time where the only reason it came up was because I think Irving Azoff started managing us. We had switch managers and Azoff and then Azoff started managing Axel mm. and the new guns. Huge conflict and of Scott, interest. Yeah, and then Scott got really super paranoid. I mean, but you don't understand with Irving it was like he's got a lot of other managers underneath him, so it was like it's so spread out. You know, because he's got so many bands, or it did at the time, that, you know, wasn't that much of a conflict. Because Guns it just kind of goes on its own. You know, and, and the thing is, is that, but Scott got really paranoid. And he was like, I think he was just on something at the time. And mm. he, like, I remember being at rehearsal at SIR and, and us talking to him getting telling one of the other managers to get Irving on the phone and him just like going on this rant to Irving like you're just trying to get Guns N' Roses back together and you I know what you're doing and he just went on this tirade and you know at the time they both Duff and Slash were like it's never gonna happen hmm. I mean up until it happened they still said it was never gonna happen yeah and they couldn't foresee it happening. And they were so stealth about any meetings. You know, they didn't want to tell anyone because if it gets out, you never know if it's because you told that person you thought you could trust. You know what I mean? So sure. I didn't hear about it really till it happened.